This week at Booster Burlington, we're gonna pour these six kids right here. And they're all relatively new to us. Yeah, so that's a good thing, right? New to me, new to you. Well, that's good. We'll, we'll share them together. How's that? So up first here, new, well not new, it's just new to Massachusetts. So if you ever traveled to New York or Jersey, you would have found this stuff years ago. But this is uh, old Chesterfield from Yingling. It's just a straight up ale. Uh, it's pre-prohibition era, 1829, back when they started that whole brick and mortar brewery down there in Pennsylvania, uh, but it's just a straight laced ale, super easy drinking. Next to that we have the Grand Pumba, if you will, of the Oktoberfest world. This is Eyinger, uh Oktoberfest, one of the highest awarded Oktoberfest straight out of Germany on the planet. Next to that we have a uh, artisanal cider from Crispin out of California. Uh, this is the sink where they use Belgian yeast and some maple syrup. To make this little concoction super tasty even though they use the belgian yeast it's still 100 percent gluten free so don't worry about that you silly eggs out there we got you covered next to that new this year is down east pumpkin cider pumpkin cider i didn't stutter uh it's delicious they use uh pumpkin pulp in here yeah yeah it's not like waiting for you at the bottom like we thought but it's a little bit drinks a little bit more dense than other ciders big full of flavor Next to that, you can't talk about, you know, the Oktoberfest season without talking about German beers. So here's just a straight-laced Doppelbach, straight out of Germany, and Dex Brewery. Uh, very tasty. Uh, had to come by. Come down, we'll pop the top. Last but not least, if any of you have ever made me a chocolate pumpkin pie, you'd be my favorite person ever. Never had a chocolate pumpkin pie, but this bottle down here, new from Evil Genius, the Trick or Treat Chocolate Pumpkin Beer. It's as cool as it tastes, and it's as delicious as it tastes, too, as it sounds, as it sounds. Whatever. It's unbelievable. You get the chocolate malt up front, then you get the uh, cinnamon nutmeg in the back. Come down this Thursday, come play.